Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome. Welcome. Uh, we're starting our program with uh, welcoming dignitaries. Council member Matt Mann, Councilwoman Deb Davis, and the staff. Mr. Chemist is here as well. Welcome, Mr. Chemist. That's a surprise. Uh, Father Joseph Cacciapelli of St. Mary Assyrian Chaldean Church, Senior Pastor Vladimir Alcase of Assyrian Evangelical Church of San Jose, Guest of Honors Sharosina Chamaki from Assyrian Democratic Movement, and Nancy Ebrahimi from Assyrian Democrats of Bay Areas, and ladies and gentlemen, I am Jack Choharbakshi the past Board of Director member of the Assyrian American Association of San Jose and the current Board of Director member of Assyrian Foundation of America in North Berkeley area in North San Francisco. On behalf, on behalf of Assyrian American Association of San Jose and Assyrian Foundation of America, I welcome you to the annual Assyrian flag raising ceremony and the celebration of the Assyrian New Year, 6,772. Today's service and ceremony is sponsored by Council Member Matt Mahan and his office, District 10, City of San Jose. Thank you, Councilman.
We will begin our program by ancient symbolic entry of the Assyrian king and queen, followed by the procession of the United States flag and the Assyrian flag. So um, the change in the location happened in the last moment. I can't tell due to what, but I'm glad to have it out here in the summer, in this beautiful weather, outdoor, and uh, it's our own home, right? Thank you. Thank you for coming for all the attendees that made it on time and uh, celebrate this with us. Um, I will ask Father Joseph Kachamili uh, to come and uh, the St. Mary Assyrian Chaldean Church to start the innovation prayer for the today's program. Salam al kilochum, tachitun spoitum, kedayu mabricha. We are glad to be here, and those who are responsible from the government, uh, we are happy to see you, and uh, whatever uh, cooperation that you do for our community, we appreciate that, and we pray for the United States of America, so that all can live with dignity, without fear, and with equality, and with a sense of dignity. Because nowadays there are so many things are under attack. So we would like peace. And we want progress and uh, the leadership of this nation all around the world to stand for freedom and to uh, support people and nations who need us. And America has it. There is a lot of generosity. And these days, I'm seeing that also for how all people are cooperating to help another nation which is under annihilation and devastation. Our nation has suffered centuries. You all know that. Under different governments, under different regimes uh, in the Middle East. But still, we are like the bird phoenix. Even we get burned, we still fly. So we live with hope. We live with courage. We live with faith. We live with our ethnicity. And we have the existence, a culture, a language, a nation. And, and today, today, we are here to um, feel that dignity and honor while, while we uh, hoist the flag. Each nation is represented by a flag in all international uh, programs. That shows we are, we have, we can still provide for the future and the progress and uh, culture of uh, freedom. We don't trust in divide and rule we trust in unity. There is diversity, but there is one or two or many reasons which bind us together. It's our nation, it's our faith. So we are proud to be here today for the flag hoisting of our nation. And when I see your smiling faces, that gives hope. When we are gloomy, we don't give positive, progressive energy. But when there is a smile, there is the hope. And we are a nation of hope, a nation of martyrs. We suffer, as Saint Tertullian would say, the blood of the martyrs is the seed of the nation and the church and the community. 
So I thank you all also for this invitation. And let us pray with all our heart that one day we also can unite as a nation, putting aside selfish and personal interests for greater ideals for our history. At the same time also I thank all those who are helping us in this great endeavor. Rabu Bhagdan Kat Jimi Vekhlacha Kat Sharukeva Kadayuma Maram Tat Ansa or Baidak Upsitana Kat Tahmaniat and Askil Kismariala Ulebawatat Nashi Kat Allah Mashpah Allen Burkate Kat Avi Huyede Bukhuba Uduzuta Kat Banach Ha Elet Ha Ituta Gurta Bdaita Shita Gurta Kat Itlen Rishan Makipah U Salas Luta Shimid Baba Bruna Ruhat Kutsha Ha Allah Ami Ya Babin Shmayana Shakur Ever Hellu Kadayu Mabricha Kadjimi Ever Lacha Beliba Basima Halan Shapa Katurahmu Kat Kileshulan Shapire Kat Smelat Fadena Azi Lakama Kat Kilian Kemser Am Imwat Hine Buhuyada Huba Shakla Pasuliate Shapire Kat Kilian Hayer Be Ikarat Bnuneu Brat Allah Nation Together with other nations Live in harmony, respect, equality, justice so that we all march towards the eternal goals that God has put in the innate nature of every human being, to be respectful, to be understanding, to be loving, to be sacrificing. We have one God who is our Father. Buddha, Akhran, Muidali Salah, Baban, Dishmeya, Paish, Kutsa, Shimu, Atiya, Melkutu, Ave Savianu, Dagdish Maya Upara, Hallan Lachma Sunkana Yuman, Shwaklan Hoben Machtan, Dagdu Pachnan Shwaklan Hayaven, Lamo Rutlan Esuna, Ella Ponsi Lamin Bisha, Bai Duki Lamelcuta, Hela Tishbucht Alalam Almin Amin. Abitu Basimi, thank you. Please stand up in honor to the Assyrian flags. We will hear from Firaz Jettu, the Vice President of the Syrian American Association of San Jose. Firaz. Good afternoon, our uh, distinguished guests, Qalsa um, Qashisha, Father Yosef. Uh, it's a tremendous honor to be here with you on behalf of the Assyrian American Association of San Jose and the Assyrian community. We welcome you and wish you a happy Assyrian New Year year 6,772, isn't that amazing? And it's a great day. This is a much more fun new year than January 1st, you gotta admit, look at it. <laughs> uh, 
So uh, we're, uh, of course, delighted to uh, continue. We're a very resilient people to continue throughout all the persecutions and genocides that we've had. We continue to uh, move forward and grow and uh, not only survive, but thrive. And you saw the uh, young kids keeping our culture and language alive, and uh, which is very close to us. It's the language of Jesus that's really uh, important to us and to our culture. Um, the year, it's very, you know, many people say, wow, really, 6,772? Uh, the tradition is it started with the first temple of Asher in uh, 4750 BC. So, uh, and we, there are records to show uh, that it's been going on for so long. Um, I do want to say that the Assyrians recorded the years not by numbers, but by giving a name, a distinguished person, um, the name of that year. So, whoever has done a lot for the community or for the people, that year is named after uh, after him or her. Uh, I'd love to bring that tradition back. It's called the Limu system, and certainly in San Jose, that would, that honor would go to uh, uh, Mrs. Rochelle Yosefian. She's done a lot for the community. Thank you, Rochelle. Uh, she's really sacrificed a lot, so appreciate it. Um, at this point, I don't want to take a lot of your time. I know you've waited a, lo a long time, and we had the change in venue. So uh, I thank you again. Thank you, Piraz. Now is the time to hear from our honorable guest, Council Member Matt Mann, and the presentation of the proclamation. It's actually pretty heavy. Okay. Um, good evening, everyone, and Happy New Year. Can you all hear me in the back? Okay, great. Um, I apologize for all the excitement at City Hall and the change of venue. I'm, I'm glad that Faraz mentioned the resilience of the Assyrian people because uh, you have to hang in there with all the many twists and turns. Next year, we will definitely raise the flag together down at City Hall, but uh, this is not a bad place to be together. Um, you know, I have to say that there's something remarkable about the Assyrian community. It's uh, seven millennia. There's, there has to be something unique. And, and it could be your toughness. It could be your pride. But I, I think more than anything, it's that sense of hospitality and community that the Assyrian community has. When I was first running for council, I knocked on 10,000 doors and had a lot of doors slammed in my face. But I always knew when an Assyrian answered the door because they would usually invite me in for lunch or dinner or maybe to stay the weekend. It was kind of incredible. And so it's been a, just a great pleasure to get to know the community here and, and just get a glimpse of the richness of it and the tradition and, and be able to celebrate with you and uh, appreciate my colleague Dev and, and predecessor Johnny being here and all the many community leaders. We'll also thank Dr. Jack for emceeing and give a special thank you. I think we should uh, give applause to Rochelle again for the incredible work. No, really, Rochelle. I've never seen anyone work as hard as Rochelle in a voluntary capacity, just out of the goodness of her heart because she loves and cares about the community and wants to preserve your cultures and traditions. So thank you, Rochelle. It's been great to work with you. For three centuries, Assyrians have reached for the blessings of freedom and opportunity in the United States. And the nearly 300,000 Assyrian Americans who have made the United States their home have greatly enriched our nation through their leadership in business, agriculture, academia, 
government, science, the arts, and so much more. Assyrians are one of the oldest civilizations known to humankind, spanning nearly seven millennia, 6,772, but who's counting? Just kidding, we're counting, we're definitely counting. Assyrians trace their origins to the cradle of civilization, Mesopotamia, or Bet Naren, located in parts of present-day Iran, Iraq, Syria, and Turkey. Assyria was named after its original capital, the ancient city of Assur, which dates to circa 4750 BC. The Assyrians and Babylonians of Mesopotamia were the first to observe the changes of months and seasons and created the calendar based on the movement of sun and moon and celebrated the lunisolar calendar with the observance of the spring equinox as the Assyrian New Year. This 12 days celebration is a symbol of rebirth, life, hope, and order. Your city, the city of San Jose, celebrates the broad cultural diversity of our residents and celebrates in your traditions and festivities, which provide our entire community with an opportunity to learn from and appreciate the various cultures we're blessed to have here. And that really is, these ceremonies like this coming together is really the foundation of what Father Joseph spoke to. That, that culture that creates dignity and safety and freedom starts with recognizing the great diversity and celebrating each other's cultures. So I wanna thank you for the opportunity to help do that today. Of course here we have a very large and vibrant population of Assyrians in District 10 who observed the Assyrian New Year on the spring equinox, which was just on March 20th. And so earlier today, we raised the Assyrian flag at City Hall. You can drive by and, or walk by and see it. It is there. And um, I just want to close by thanking you again and sharing this proclamation that my colleagues and I signed and commemorated at our council meeting on the 22nd that proclaimed March 20th, oh, there go my papers, March 20th as Assyrian New Year in the city of San Jose. So thank you again. And who am I giving this proclamation to, Rochelle? I think you should come up here. Okay, all of the, a representative from all of the partner organizations. Why don't we come up? Let's get a photo. Maybe my colleague Dev wants to join us. Can we do a quick photo? And Johnny, come on up too. Emeritus. All right. Thank you all and Happy New Year. Thank you. Yes. So, thank you. Representatives from churches and Assyrian organizations, Ms. Malochon Pardon, and Firaz Pardon, Gianochon, Ms. Malochon. Okay, at this time of program, I was told that the kids, our wonderful kids, have prepared a special song and dance for us. So we're going to ask them to come up.
شابر تاد شابریاتم برد آشکر راهیچ لعاتب ناتنی بر بیش افرد عمرم سرت دمارم مهرای آتب ناتنی آزانی انتیانه من رختم خود روانه صحبت مهنیانه جود خرامد ناتنی
Kids. Great job.
How about a big hand for these young guys and girls? Thank you all. Line up. Avitun Raba Basimi, Yudahasam, Yudasamaha, Deshnet, Len, Redaniel Suri, Red Adonet, Red Lahamuton, Ekmadona, Tiena, Biakvakate, Mokravakla. Adiba Talon Menechut, Meneshume, the Tiny Le, Hadik and Besmalohun. در بدایتون این کتاب از استن شربی، این کتاب بسمنتلا، هی، این بحث خب نیستن، او کم داشت نشابرت ایلاق، یومد نیستن، خنده داشت نت خب نیستن بیا وقت. سو، ادی شرخ مخه شمخ، جانی، هرموزی، بسیم، پاکت. Ashok Tamraz. Basima Taqir. Melanie Shemshayu. Basimta. Shailo Shamuil. Jodel Mirza. Basimta. Kiana Yayovak. Basimta. Mariela Janubi. Basimta. Inana Tamraz. Basimta. Ileana Isho. Basimta. Your name? Olivia. Good job. There you go. <laughs> Tiffany. Yes, Megana. Good job. Aria. Yes. <laughs> Hold it. Peter. Good job. Maddie. Maddie. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Good job. Emily. Good job. Charlotte. Yes. Good job. Good job, Perekulunte. Basim Raba. Thank you, Miss Monica. Wonderful coordination. Thank you so much. Makhleta, la khadu kitat vala mi qurta Noela. Rabi Noela zet anan minta. Har bade dana min flag bearers. Daniel u Jonah avi raba basi mi qat hoye rakhlan kida khurza. Thank you, guys. All right. Uh, we will have a, a couple speakers for tonight. It's at this time I'd like to ask Sharosina Chamaki. She is the secretary of a Syrian democratic movement in Santa Clara chapter. She will have a little speech. <laughs> Baruchwan Shita Khatat Ishtarpe Shawamo Shawi Tre Kulibne Umten Churikiton Lacha Uharbed on top Anibne Umten Gupinyate Prishi Prishi U Bemas Ayot Yudaa Gashukana Aldaha Hurza Tahniatan U Barachiatan Kablon Abhind anedanate u go metchet shene haraye Bishmaeva habre u tebe labasime nisbet ekenayutet kulidunye Inamintam in Allaha Mintam in Allaha aha sheeta Bene untangu atret ava hatan Mzuyichlun Khabnisan Ishta Alpe Shavam Shavitre Bumditat Nuhadra Uvilun Kablanet Erche Men Kuli Gibane Dunye Khamenyane Gurach Bedaiton Men Lacha Atret America Shuriklun 
Guja Hazuyaha, Uharbed on Tamek Diantela, Kurbaka, Erpi Hal Erpi, Hamshaganate, Men Elime Aturaye, Men Kuledunye, Pishait, Atrawatid, Europe, Bemas Ayutit, Shutasit, Gishru, Shuriklun, Um Zoyichlun, Aha Ida Tosh Aitanaya. Go Astrid Avahan Avahatan Ahamasha Zuyahat Habinisan Shele Shopa U Shurile Treumane Menkant Habinisan Mentlaibier Ha Be Hakma Zuyahi Prishi Prishi Go Kunim Dinate Acht Miokra Firas Mutre Ahashita Eva Prisa Gu Kulim Dinatit Erak in a Gumetre Dentre Yumani Gukulus Shutasit Zoa Kantrunit Zoa Yalibinat Berzayehwa at Jimiana Sakulina O Mzayuchina Aha Eda Uherbedona Gu Yumet Habinisan قد يومت ورا بلالي إيمان دميخ خوخمان تاما إيوا يومت خبني سان و تاما مزيو خوا قربا إسري هل إسري خمشا ألب من بنا أمتان ويلون شاركان جو ميزلتات خبني سان و يوولون آها إيجارتا قشلطانات Baghdad, O Harbedana Parliament, Erbel, Kad Bne Umten, Kulena Eat, Snete, Ekela, O Harbedana Shwaklun Ahabukara, Ka Kuledunye, Kad Bdonid Gabayate, Eka Brishena, O Mani Toshuele, Kalit Umten. Udahi anit litlun shopa u sneta membne umted dian in a beshkala kursie u shopani go a parliament shultanat bagdad o harbedana go erbel yan tanach eklimet kurdistan. آن لحظه بیان لبیان ماریا خانا و اخشی بیان تنان منتام شرکت کل خان پریشاید من شو تابوتت آتور ق مریست آه خورزا گود ده یوم شابیرا عیتون با سیم رابا و خج خیتا باروخ و خب نیسان او پی ویند آه شیت بد آیا شیت شنا او شلما قیل دنیا آما آم امتدیان اخنن زیگاو خب نیسم بریخا آل کل خون تیم تدمن تسلی من اخ میآورد راشل او کل شات پوتد آتور علی تو بسیم Thank you very much. <coughs> Our next speaker is, <coughs> excuse me, Nancy Ebrahimi. She is the Syrian Democrats of the Bay Area representative of them. I'm here today on behalf of Democrats, uh, Assyrian Democrats of the Bay Area, to greet the new Assyrian year, the year of 6,772, with our fellow Assyrians and our American friends. Before anything, I want to appreciate the Syrian American Association of San Jose uh, for extending the invitation and giving us the opportunity to be here and celebrate this ancient great new year with all of you. And a special thanks goes to Rochelle Youssefian and her team for all the hard work and effort toward our community. The Syrian New Year is also called a Quito or Nisan festival. It is one of the oldest recorded festivals in the world. 
Assyrian mythology tells of a story where the uh, goddess of love marries the vegetation god. The unity which occurred during the spring equinox ensured the renewal of life and blessing the earth with fertility. This myth was central to the Akito celebration. America, uh, Assyrians came from a great empire. They are the descendants of powerful leaders. And they had many golden years ruling the ancient world. This great civilization conquered so many and at last defeated and was conquered. Ever since, Assyrians are trying to survive harsh treatment of ancient and modern world. Assyrians are a proud nation. They have protected their language, culture, and traditions for all these years. And their only hope is to pass this great heritage to the next generation. Assyrians are the indigenous settlers of Mesopotamia which was located in modern Middle East. But due to m many wars and regional political and tribal conflicts, a big portion of these Assyrian populations were given the opportunity to migrate to the Western countries. To countries like America, countries that the rule of land was founded on democracy. I would like to quote a sentence from Woodrow Wilson he once said, democracy is not much of a form of government as a set of principles. Principles such as equality, freedom, human rights, and so on and so forth. This democratic system and the established social justice provides us, Assyrians, an opportunity to live peacefully among the great nations alongside uh, the other races, ethnicities, and beliefs. Democracy is like an air we breathe. We shall strive to improve and preserve and protect it. With this in mind, a number of Assyrians in this, in this area came together last year, established the Assyrian Democrats of the Bay Area. This organization was accredited in July 1st, 2021, as an affiliate of Santa Clara County Democratic Party. With all that said, Assyrian Democrats of Bay Area would love to wish a happy and blessed new Assyrian New Year. May this ancient New Year bring peace, health, happiness, and prosperity on Earth. I would also like to greet um, New Year with Assyrian language. Shlama lochun. Men gibed aturay demokratet be area baru khovan shit khata aturata shit ishta al peshav moshavitre qakul aturay mughbe. Etlan hivi gudash shit khata aturata ati asazgert ya umtan shlama gudunye. Khilmana u kashiruta qakul aturaye u mali le bawatan min hemanuta hivi u khubba qaudal bit khatmana a barakht shita khata bkha krita mshukhta min miqra sargun warda anhar mshukhta pishla ktifta gushitid alpo ajmo ichi yum ditid urmi shimit mshukhta ila Sluta Denisa. Tila Dono Rusia Kiana, Tuch Burvana Kampatan. Makem Poche Morish Shoche, Mapres Loche by Nathan. Mother Prihe, Makem Tliche, Rechi Gonchem Lebavata. Bit mi akrochluch, bit chaprochluch, ya nisan. Mezrik shimshe, mehdil nashe, kalben plishe, chaduta. Bzuk barzara, bidishta watura, yo adora, brivi chuta. Majri nare, mezmer dere, bri ad sore, bipsi chuta. Vi ad katan, knishta bnatan, 
یعنی سن دری ات خوب به کل لب وی خبیب به کل نشه مغدی لپیش من یخ لخیشه بسم لریشه ده کل خشه وی مارمانا گعاد دانا حل قرآنا لبار نشه بد پر شخلوخ لمن شخلوخ یعنی سن پتوخ اد پرده مقوخ ورده سموق و زرده بدشیته شقول والیته به ما تومدیته به کل بریته و امواتن هایر قاتن بنونن بناتن بابن ساون و سویاتن به قنق نخلوخ به تانت نخلوخ یعنی سن میگی بید اسیرین دموکرات آف بی ایریا با روخون شیت خطا توریتا شیت اشتال پیش و موشوی تریقه کلو خون شیتو خونو یا برخدا Alright, thank you Speaker Nasi Ebrahimi um, It is almost time to close our ceremony So uh, with that um, We ask Pastor, Senior Pastor Vladimir Al-Khase From Assyrian Evangelical Church to come and uh, give us the honor and prayer. Um, I was just informed that Senator Cortese is on his way, and uh, since he's making an effort to come, if he does come, we appreciate if you wait, and we would like to hear a few words from him. Thank you. Um, ای قرار لقاتی اودیو لخ خا مخونی ون سرستو تا خا سودانا یوما امید آرز ویا خوادو و خانه مدر باین من راشل و شوت آپوتا دن من تابوت خاطر دنی خورزد متویه نه آن قاینا. I want to also thank the dignitaries and our government officials. I see Mr. Matt Mayhem and Mr. Johnny Hamas were here. Appreciate all your support through the years and uh, God bless you. Um, my brother, uh, Father Joseph, uh, summed it up really well. Uh, as he said, uh, we are known by our nation and on our faith. And, and that, in case of Assyrians, is uh, more than just a statement. Uh, the words resilience came to mind and was mentioned many times. We are a resilient nation. And there's a real reason for it. There is something unique about our nation, the Assyrians. And that is, we are the only nation that the Lord God sent a Jewish prophet to our nation, to the king, and asked our nation to return back to him. And that's recorded in the history book of all times, the Bible. Most of you are familiar with the book of Jonah. Who goes to the city? He goes to the king of Assyrians. And as you know the story, the king of Assyria, as he hears the call of the Lord to repent and go back to him, he steps down from the throne. He takes off his royal robe. He proclaims a fast for the nation, young and old, they were to stop so that the Lord may relent and save our nations. And in the Lord's faithfulness, he did. There is no other nation that the Lord has sent anyone like that. And the reason we're resilient since that day, the Lord had a call on us. But that's not when it ended. That was in about 650 BC. Later on, a well-known prophet named Isaiah, who most of you are familiar with his writing in Isaiah 53, prophesies of the coming of a king, of Lord Jesus coming, and his prophecy comes true. In the same book, Isaiah does some other things. In Isaiah chapter 19, Isaiah prophesies, and the name Assyria is mentioned again. I would like to read that portion for you. In Isaiah 53, 
In Isaiah 19, from verse 23, it says, On that day, there will be a road from Egypt to Assyria, and the Assyrians will come into Egypt, and the Egyptians into Assyria, and the Egyptians will worship with the Assyrians. On that day, Israel will be the third party to Egypt and Assyria, a blessing in the midst of the earth, whom the Lord of armies, Yahweh Sabaoth, has blessed, saying, Blessed is Egypt, my people. Blessed is Assyria, the work of my hands. And blessed is Israel, my inheritance. That's a prophecy yet to be fulfilled. There's a reason why the Lord saved the Assyrian nation. The best for the Assyrians is yet to come as we're going to be participating in what the Lord has in the coming days as our, the return of our Lord's coming near. That's who we are. And I want to say the identity of the Assyrians as a nation is tied to their faith in Lord Jesus Christ and how faithful we stay to that call. That's our identity. That's who we are. All glory to God. Why he picked us in the sovereign will is his call. Our responsibility is, are we going to stand up and are we going to respond to what he says and be the blessings to the nations? And that's how the Lord Jesus is. Today is a great day of celebration. And this celebration truly is about celebrating the goodness of the Lord of heaven, God Almighty, Lord Jesus Christ, who loves his people so much that he sent his only begotten son to die for us. So today, we shall be part of the people of God for all who call upon his name and return. And our name, the Assyrians, in fact, will be mentioned until the ends of the earth as this book of history will not disappear and will be read by all who know. We are to, as Assyrians, stand up and take our place in history as we follow the Lord Jesus Christ. Today is a blessed day along the path. And I bless each and every one of you who have come here today and may this be a blessed day for you. Let's pray. Lord Jesus, Father, we thank you for today as we've come in this beautiful day, beautiful place, and with the people who you've called by your name. And Father, we just come and say how you called us out of the nations of the world to be with people of Egypt and Israel as a part of your plan, part of a plan for the salvation of the world, Lord. We bless you. We thank you. Father, we just pray that you, with the power of your Holy Spirit, will empower us to take our stand, to take our step where we are to fulfill what you've called us to do, Lord Jesus. Father, bless this community. Father, we just pray for the peace of the world. May your peace reign in our lives. Pray all of this in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you. Thank you, Pastor Latimer. Um, I think at this time, it's as uh, the ceremony comes to an end, but before we end it, the usual routine is we have to allow king and queen to depart first. So with that, can we introduce the king and queen, please? So at this time, Batalban uh, men flag bearers, Azel Kale, and King and Queen Premi, uh, a proper departure. Biyan tanan minta men Melka o Malikta flag bearers, Melka o Malikta o King and Queen advisors. 
قتيل أرول شقل هوي رخل وخردن سقل so um, flag bearer Jonah Daniel King Petion Queen Sarah advisors Abigail Kiana Brina Basim Raba Ey 
دیدن نریم شد شیطان نه، تو یوما بوده یا خب نیست نه، زنی 